Hello everyone. Well, it's been a while since I got to make a video for the channel. Um, moved jobs, changed cities, languages, uh, even career choices. So it's been it's been a difficult time to be able to find a free space to be able to do things that I want to do, and shooting videos is one of them. Unfortunately, I had to also reduce my collection significantly. Now I have uh, two reptiles and two arachnids. And that's about it. Having a uh, young kid, he's about to turn two years old now, and all the responsibilities is getting to be tough to take care of my animals properly. So um, that's why I couldn't make any videos. But Today I will at least do a video and I will try to do at least once a month to be able to show what I have and the progress I made. And long time followers of my channel will know that I used to keep the animal that I will show to you before. Um, and I always love the species so it's good to get back to them. Alright, let's get him out. And let's zoom in. As you guys can see, we have a little baby banded Gila monster. He's very cool. He's already getting used to me. And he's been here for a couple days now. The first day his mouth was open when he saw me. But now it's a lot better reaction. So let me try to get him in frame. There we go. And this is the first time that I will try to feed him. So hopefully this is a good reaction. I see that the animal is definitely interested. Oh, not a lot of interest. I don't think that uh, he has ever been hand fed, so this is new. And I just woke him from his little nap here, so let's see if he's going to go for it or not. So uh, obviously this is a venomous animal and obviously I do not recommend anybody to do what I do here. But I have been working with healers for a long time, on and off. And I know that the best way to get them used to you is to feed them like this. So they know that food comes from you and you're not a danger to them. But this little guy is not very much interested, as of now at least. Of course with healers, once they bite they will eat. So sometimes teasing them a little bit helps. So another thing that helps for sure is putting a little bit of egg in the mix. Sorry for the focusing issues with the camera. I'm using an EOS to 
film this and it has its autofocus thing that's a little difficult to handle sometimes. So he is a little agitated now, he doesn't really know me and it's not very you know easy to trust a giant hand. And he doesn't I don't want him to go for my finger, that's for sure. Alright, so what I'll do is I will leave the mouse in there. I will also bring an egg to see if he'll be interested in that at least. And if he eats while I'm getting the egg, then it's okay. Well, it looks like the egg yolk I got um, ended up being quite useless. Or maybe we'll get him to drink a little bit, huh? Let's try that. So Gila monsters in the wild, they actually do eat a lot of egg, it's one of their main uh, prey items. So they love egg and as you can see this one immediately started licking the egg yolk. That is very nice to see. All right. So I wanted to introduce this little guy to you. Um, 
I'm not going to stress him out much since this was his first feeding. I hope you liked it, but you'll definitely get to see more of him in the future. Uh, just for those of you who don't know the species, again, this is a Heloderma suspectum cinctum, a banded Gila monster from uh, the southwestern United States. Right? Thanks for watching.